crowd meant the start of Monday's Dublin Senior Football Championship decider between defending champion St Vincent's and Oliver Plunkett's own Rua was delayed by 10 minutes. When the action got underway, Bernard Brogan got the first score after a pass from brother Allen. Oliver Plunkett's own Rua were three points to no score ahead when the younger Brogan capitalised on some poor defending but missed the game's first goal chance. Spurred on by the miss, Vincent's came roaring back into it, this point by Kieran Dorney levelling matters, three points apiece after 15 minutes. It was then the turn of the defending champions to miss a goal chance, Gavin Burke blazing over for a point after some good team play. With 10 minutes to go to half time, this score from Alan Brogan put Oliver Plunkett's own Rua 5-4 ahead. But that was his team's last score of the half as Vincent's reeled off three unanswered points including this one from Gavin Burke. Tommy Conroy's side 7-5 up at the break. Ten minutes into the second half, Vincent's went 10-6 ahead, Kieran Dorney doing the damage. Gavin Burke put them 12-7 up just a few minutes later. And when Rory Trainer pointed to leave the score at 14-8 with just nine minutes left, it looked like it was all over. It would have been if Trainer had taken this goal chance, but it was well saved by Alan O'Mara. With the clock ticking down and Plunkett's badly needing a goal, they got it. Alan Brogan punching a high ball to the net to cut the gap to two. Bernard Brogan's free with a minute to go left the deficit at the bare minimum, but Vincent's hung on. Back-to-back -back titles for the Marino men, no first title for Oliver Plunkett's own Rua. Well, really mentally, mentally exhausting and uh, but just a feeling of, I suppose, relief, satisfaction. That, I mean, you said it was exhausting, but the last few minutes was really hard in the mouth still. I know, so it, it, was a, it was a great goal really, I mean, you got up very well and it's always a dangerous, you know, type of ball into the square and it can be difficult for defenders to deal with that and um, we possibly should have had maybe two points ahead of that and we were always feeling on the line you know we're not we're not taking our chances and we should have been a little bit uh, more ahead a little bit of a more gap but like in fairness to Plunkett's uh, own road they never stopped and they worked and worked it hasn't really sunk in maybe in a few years time you look back and say yeah it was great to do it but it wasn't something we spoke about in the start of the year, it was all about just this was a new campaign, a new Dublin Championship, and we weren't talking about defending anything. Incredible crowd here tonight, you know, bank holiday Monday night. I mean, uh, uh, it's great to see, and, and I, think, I think they got value for money. It was a fantastic game.